What's up guys, Carson here, and in today's video, I'm going to be going back to the basics and discussing what web hosting is and how it works. Now, web hosting essentially is the service of providing storage space for a website or application on a server on the internet. Now, once your website is made available on the internet, it can be accessed by other computers and users who are connected to the internet. So, how does web hosting work? Well, web hosts are companies that rent out their services and technologies to host websites on the internet. Once the web hosting company hosts your website, users can access it by typing in your web address in their web browser. Now when they do this, their computer connects to the server your website is hosted on. And the server in turn serves the website to your visitor in their web browser. This means Firefox, Google Chrome, whatever you access the internet with. So how do we know which is the best web hosting plan for us or any other users who are going to be using it? Well, there are several web hosting options available. To know which one would be right for your business, you have to ask yourself a few questions, which I'm going to tell you right now. Number one, what kind of website do you plan to host online? A blog, an e-commerce portal, a news website? Because this is going to determine how much web traffic you expect and how robust the infrastructure required to host your website should be. Now, if you'd like to check out my recommendations, I will put the link in the description below and there will actually be some special discounts available to you as well. So definitely check that out. Now, there are several ways you can host your website, so I'm going to go ahead and cover those right now. The first way is shared hosting, and if you have a blog or are just a small business that's starting out, shared hosting is a good option to start with. It's the most affordable hosting option available as your server space is shared by other websites. Now, it's simple and it's easy to use as well. Now, it's really, really great, but on the other hand, because you share space and resources with multiple other websites on the same server, an overload with another website getting too much traffic will actually cause your website to slow down. You basically have minimal control over the server. If you are looking for shared hosting though, I'll include links to special discounts in the description below. Now, the next hosting option I want to cover is WordPress hosting. If you have a WordPress blog or website, it is actually recommended that you purchase a WordPress hosting package as it is specifically optimized to cater to your WordPress website. Essentially, WordPress specific hosting tends to load faster for WordPress websites compared to other type of hosting. This is because it is built optimized for WordPress. The next type of hosting I want to mention is reseller hosting, and if you want to get into the hosting business, purchasing reseller hosting actually enables you to rent out or resell the same hosting services provided by the parent company to you, but to other people. So with resell hosting, you can also upsell every other web service offered by the parent or web host, which is really good. Next up, I want to mention dedicated hosting. Now, dedicated hosting gives you complete administrative control of your server and access to the full root access. You can choose to install any software you want to on that server. Next up though, I do want to talk about VPS hosting. You can essentially think of VPS hosting as a higher, stronger, more advanced form of shared hosting. While you do share a server with other websites, thus making it not dedicated, you are assigned resources that are not shared with the other properties. So if you cannot afford a dedicated server, but want to step up from shared, VPS is the way to go. I hope I've given you a basic understanding of what web hosting is and how it works. You can find the special discounts for the best web hosting providers by clicking the link in the description of this video. Please do leave a like, subscribe, and as always, see you next time.